So we can press this button and bring it down. And then we can go underneath the couch. Wow. All right, so a lot of you may know that uh, my wife loves cleaning. No, 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 this isn't like some joke about, you know, the woman should clean. My wife legitly enjoys cleaning, like looks forward to it. So today I have a new product that she'll absolutely love. Ugh. Special thanks to this company for sending me their really big, pretty heavy, kind of really hard to hold in this position vacuum. Now this vacuum is a handheld vacuum, completely rechargeable, but it does something that I have not seen the other handheld vacuums do, including a Dyson, which is, uh, oh. well, there's no picture of it. I'll, you can see it like bends so that it can go under a couch. I, I thought that was really cool. So I told them, send it my way and we'll get you a video made. So we're gonna get on the overhead rig. We're gonna unbox it see everything that comes in here and then i'm gonna hand it off to my wife and uh, let her you know do her thing with it either way click like click subscribe indulge in your life at indulgeclothing.com for the merch and now let's check out this new vacuum the bigger items are always the hardest ones to unbox let me bring this up some all right so a little look around the box here this is the ultra cleaner s2 the osv-103 cordless stick vacuum Smart helper for deep cleaning. Again, special thanks to them for sending this to me. And by the way, I love the green. Ugh. Sold in 50 plus countries, trusted by 200 million plus users. Keep exploring. US version, uh, looks like it's rated power is 380 watts and the battery capacity is 2,500 milliamp hours. Dust cup capacity is 800 milliliters and its usage type is dry. It's not made to be wet, of course. But this side has some more info. A powerful suction, flexible, bendable tube design, touch control, easy to empty dust, automatic adjust suction, reinforced dual filtration system, ultra long runtime, smart suction indicator bottom don't have anything and the top just has a handle so let's open it up see what we have oh yeah looks like we have a little sandwich of stuff here let me totally knock that that's why these big boxes are really difficult uh, so that's it for in this box all right right on top we have the instruction manual everything you'll need to know there and uh, let's go through some of the accessories. So this is like the uh, crevice tool. Nice, ooh, ooh, feels nice. Doesn't seem bendable. And there's this tool. All right, nice, nice. Then there's this tool. Very nice. This is like adjustable. Look at that, <laughs> cool. And here's our flexible tube. Oh, uh, so like that part's flexible and when you need it straight, you lock it right in. And then you need it flexible, boom. And now it's able to flex. That's very unique. I've, of all the vacuums I've ever had, none of them had anything that did that. <laughs> we can even do this, fanciness. Let's take the top part off here and we're into more stuff. All right, this is the main uh, suction head, I guess you would call it. Got the... Uh, wheels on it little rubbery wheels model osv 103 i love the blue color they used personally my wife will love it too she likes teal and our whole kitchen's teal so uh nice nice okay. does this one lock oh it does and then you just kind of pull it okay what else we got down in here we got the cleaning brush this is, of course, to uh, clean it out and uh, cut out your hairs that get caught in there. And this looks to be our battery. Very nice battery. That looks to be the release to take it off. Okay. And this looks to be a wall mountable charger. Wait a minute. Yeah, it looks like this would go on the wall and then you'd plug this into power. I'll have to verify that. Got the screws for mounting it. Here we go. Yeah, there's our power brick. And from what I can see, yeah, it looks like this goes into this. You mount this to your wall and then somehow I think it charges through these two connectors here. Very cool. And then lastly, a little extra filter. That side's up, that's good to know. The uh, main vacuum. 
And that's it for this. So here's the main vacuum. That same nice color. Look at that. Looks like your filter is right here. Look at that. Wow. So easy. And then just kind of goes right back in. And so this is, seems to be your dustpan. Got a button here for quick release. A maximum. And yeah, this kind of turns and locks. There you go. That's how you take that out. Okay. Lock that back in. All right. An auto. Looks like you can turn it up. And then just your trigger. Very, very nice. And it does seem... Let's see. Where's our battery? So here's our battery. And the battery would connect this way. Yeah, so it looks like these little metal connectors here. Yeah. What, uh... Bam. So you do. You can wall mount to charge it. Or, of course, uh, if you don't want to wall mount, you can plug the charger directly into the uh, power adapter right here. So that'll do it for the unboxing of this Ultra Cleaner S2 cordless stick vacuum. Now, uh, let's put this thing together and actually try it out. So let's uh, let's throw it together real quick. We will. Uh, we're gonna put everything in except the battery. So we'll go ahead and stiffen that one, that one. Then you can see the little connectors go in with the connectors and line right up perfectly. So now it's in, and then I could use that to go underneath a couch. Now, of course, then this part just goes down into this part like so, and then it will stay up if you uh, want to set it up like that so now the vacuum is essentially together we uh we might try these out a little later but for now we'll just get this plugged up because like i said we can just plug it in there and uh we'll get this charging and then we'll come back and show you this actually working i wish i would have recorded it yesterday but there's a little flashing light there when this is let's uh let's give this a little test Put this in because there was a huge mess from all the unboxings so you can see all these little white pieces from the foam let's power it on look at that it's got a little battery in here whoa all right so uh let's try it out uh, yeah i like when i go over something once and it's done and look at this it don't have a ball but it's very irritating it's also pretty quiet. Yeah. And light. We'll have to get some more cereal or something to really dry it out, but yeah. it's definitely taking up all this foam with uh, no problems at all. Yeah. I like it. My iPhone's favorite really in the floor. <laughs> See the swivel though? It's very yeah. swivelly. See it all moving in there? <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> See so, you know, all this nice grass is going to be done. Yeah, one pass. So we can press this button and bring it down, and then we can go underneath the couch. Wow. That's ingenious. Yeah. So now under the couch is getting clean. I love that. The only thing it's missing is a camera to show you what's underneath the couch. <laughs> and then you just go right back up, and now you're, you know, back into normal mode. It's very nice. So to turn it up, uh, I thought you just pressed it, but it actually is a slider. So now it's on full, or you can leave it on auto, which is what we've had it on, where it's been automatically kind of adjusting the suction. Let's see if it does this one. One faster. I gotta say, it's a pretty darn good vacuum. Yeah, yeah. So, it's got 84%. Yep. And it's on auto, so if I slide it. Okay. And then every, so every time you turn it on, you see that. 
nice. Very nice. All right, so yeah, we just hit that button to release it. And then we're able to take the crevice tool here and it just slides into place. Bingo, and now it's got a crevice tool. So now like we can do the couch or something. Which, there's not much on the couch, but it's still for it. So we also have the two-in-one attachment, which, you know, you can use it this way or slide this up and use it that way. And then there's also an upholstery brush, which both of these go on the same way. Just slides off. And then you notice there's a groove here and a groove here. And then you'll see there's a groove there and a groove there. And so it just slides right in. And that should do it for this little handheld vacuum. You may know we've did a lot of these. And in terms of suction, this one seems to have phenomenal suction. And also, I mean, you can see, I've still got 79. I've still got 79% battery, which this is, I think, the only one I've ever had that's actually showed me how much battery I have. The other ones just die. This is also the only one I've gotten where you can charge it from the mount mounted on the wall, which is just much neater and cooler. So between all the attachments, the suction, the charging, I definitely, and I think my wife as well, would give this one two big thumbs up. Right, babe? Right. So I'll, of course, have this exact model linked down below in the description if you'd like to grab one of these for your household. Very convenient. Almost forgot even the bendable pole to get under the couch. Can't beat that. So thanks for watching. Click like, click subscribe, indulge in your life at indulgeclothing.com for the merch, and we'll see you in the next one. Deuces.